Oh, that's nice. Like that. Ooh, yeah. It's like that's what I call strong subtle. What's going on, everyone? Welcome to another episode of MRI TV. Today, I'm going to be reacting to Twice Special. I know this song because my girlfriend plays it. Uh, you know, I, I know the song. I don't think I've ever seen the music video or the reaction video. Uh, but as this is one, this is one also one of the other videos that was requested in the comments. Uh, so I appreciate you guys giving the feedback and you know everything that I've done so far in regards to sharing these videos. Uh, I appreciate the feedback. Keep sending your requests, whatever you guys want me to, to react to, and I'll keep you know creating content like this. So, uh, anyways, let's just jump right into it. Nice, nice strong beginning with the block formation that's like a nice little illusion it's like like oh look we're just a line and then <laughs> all of a sudden all this kind of like kind of grows out of it which is cool so it goes from here to that again and it's also like as i've said through other videos like visual shapes so it's like going from here to here is really cool so all right let's keep going Ooh, that was nice. So a little feeling a little short here. Could be the camera angle. Look, uh, look at her angle. Uh, she's like fully extended. She's half. So I'm not sure what they're trying to go for here. Uh, but I'm pretty sure they're supposed to extend. Or it could be a timing thing. Like she already extended. Boom. She's just pulling in. She's pulling in a little too much. So as whereas her opposite is pulling in very like subtly. But either way, it's a style, really cool visual. See, look how fast you pulled that back in. Oh, this is definitely, it reminds me of my friend's choreography, my best friend sometimes choreography, Lazelle Marie. Very strong, like, moments, like, strong shapes and then a quick moment, but, like, not so much, like, uh, uh, in terms of choreography, but more about, like, character and, like, ownership of, like, ownership of your presence. So, which is what I'm, I'm like, that's the vibe I'm getting off from, from this. Like that, ooh, yeah. It's like, that's what I call strong subtle. Oh, okay, someone was like half a second early? Oh yeah, someone was early. Yeah. Boom, yeah. I'm pretty sure they they noticed it when they ran the, when they watched the rehearsal video. Yeah, definitely, like a count early. That's like can't can't ignore. That's not something that you're gonna that you're gonna miss definitely. But you know, make mistakes happen. This is why we do rehearsals. You work your ass off, make it hard in rehearsals, so that way when you perform it, it it's just easy. You just it's almost like walking. That's why that's why I don't, I don't understand because when I, I'm known for goofing off in rehearsals, but I also take pride in making sure that I know my shit because <laughs> because if I goof off and I don't know my shit, the, like the people I, I the choreographers are definitely gonna be pissed, and I wouldn't be surprised they wouldn't want to work work with me again. No matter what, in my opinion, you're always gonna feel some sort of like some sort of excitement before you on stage. And, but in my opinion, I, f I think if you rehearse and make, I guess, rehearsals quote unquote hard, you push yourself as much as you can to make sure that you can do like the routine like five times in a row without mistakes. Like, I, there's like this level of comfort that you want to be at where you're, you're where you don't have to be mindful. You don't have to force think yourself in a sense about the choreography is just like becomes natural to you because it's it's become muscle memory and that leaves you to think about like more high level things like performing enjoying the moment you know th that's why i think a lot of the work and i'm going to continue saying this much respect to all the artists doing this is going to be in the rehearsals uh so that way they can enjoy performing for the audience because if they're like overly stressed about choreography like trying to make sure that they look good then it's, it's going to be it's going to show in how they perform so quick tangent there but it gave me like another five, three minutes for this video. <laughs> That's tight. I love that. I like. I love the use of the, the that that spacing right there, going from like the the back corner of the room, and smooth 
transition to the center. That's a nice little like pony move right there. Shouts out to all these choreographers that I've been watching do their, their work. I don't, I'm not the best at names, and I don't know a lot, whole lot of choreographers, uh, to be honest, because, you know, I just, I just don't. There's so many talented people out there. So just shouts out to all the choreographers putting in the, in the, in their work. I like that little surprise happening right there. So again, smooth af. Formation changes coming up right there. That was nice. It's just, oh, I'm just going to walk over here. I like this right here. Again, I, I they use hiding the surprise. Like, oh, hello. We got some more people. Ooh. That was nice. It wasn't like for for that, uh, such a strong part of the song where it's, it sounds like a kind of like it feels like a band could be used for a big movement. They used it for a subtle movement. Yeah, so for me, I would have been like, yeah, yeah, because <laughs> that's just me. Uh, if I was like doing this in a freestyle, I'll do some sort of blow up or something. Like that, because I did something similar to that in, in my choreography. Shit, they might have, maybe I have seen this. <laughs> Da, 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 da. <laughs> Ooh, I like that. So look at look at those texture changes, like like strong, 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 and milk it. Da, 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 go. Uh, it's like a, not really milk, but more like flow. I like that the those using those arms for formation change and transition. I like that. I like the use of the fingers. It's generally normally you, you generally hardly ever see like finger motions in choreography or when you're like far away but I like you know just wanted to appreciate that I really I really like that move <laughs> Cuz Nope back That's a little rotating transition to the next one. Walk, 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 boom. Something feels weird. I don't know. It could be the colors that's really kind of throwing me off. The lighting in this room. It just feels unbalanced. Probably because there's dark colors here. It's just my eye. No. Actually, no. It's because the placement right here. She, I, she might be a little too far in or she's just... Mo moving a little farther off to her left which makes it feel the f the formation feels unbalanced you know i'm just it's just some again this is small shit small shit that regular people don't notice yeah she's a little like, a little further look at the, her foot she's like practically right behind her whereas her foot right outside so she, these guys would need to push out a little bit more but I'm pretty sure that it was it just looked fine when they actually performed it and when they filmed it. Ooh, fuck, ripples. I, I, again, I, I, as I've said in previous ones, I hate ripples, but I appreciate it, the people that can execute them. Nice. That was cool. Nice little, like, I guess, ripple or breakdown into that. I also hate doing f formations that somehow end up in a line. I don't know why. I just feel like it's gonna make everything look messy. That's cool. I love that. I love the I love the levels. That's what he's. I love that. And that. I'm just gonna appreciate that the strong subtle. 
I love the intention with the arms too. The, I love the intention with the arms. It's not just like this kind of like weird motion, but this like kind of like a very intentional like ha like I call these Magneto hands because if you, I, I read comic books and Magneto when he does his powers like yeah look at look I um, I don't know if it's an actual term, but that's how, what I learned in, in art school. Man, going from like a, a, a centered formation, then ah oh, nice into a spread out. Like almost what V-ish formation or almost like an M, yeah. So she's probably in their line. These two, yeah. I would, if I was an audience member, I would much rather watch this from the top view than like uh, than the front, because I wouldn't be able to like as you know, I, it'd be fun to like see them perform because they like the performance is all here, but as a uh, as the dancing, I would like to watch it from the top. Ooh, that was good too. A little close in there, but. Hey, hey, nice change up. Oh, hold on, let's go. Hey. Love those. I kind of appreciate that. Like, they use that a lot in terms of, like I, these like these lines into like the next thing. They do that a lot for this. I think I feel like I, a lot of the K-pop videos I've seen they do that. They do it well. And again, I uh, for me I, I'm not a big fan of using straight lines. Like either it's like towards the audience or to the side. I just feel paranoid about like things looking clean. So. Oh, that's a fun formation. What is this? It's like a almost like a an N. <laughs> oh, that's nice. Look at that movement. The, going from the front to the back. Nice. I like what the, I like the levels. Ah, uh, you you can feel like the the energy going up with the choreography, going like you can definitely feel the energy going up as they're about to close out the song. Oh, I like that. It was going. It, it's almost like going up, 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 and then like a small little like little just bloom with the choreography. I was gonna watch that again. I feel like there's so much I'm I'm missing. Look at that! This is go. The energy is up the whole time. She killed that. Yeah, I'd expect a big bang out of it, but ah, big bang. But uh, it's very subtle. All right, so that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Uh, if you like this type of video, make sure you hit like, subscribe, share this with your friends who th you think might enjoy it. Uh, if you guys got any other suggestions, uh, things you want me to react to aside from K-pop or even more K-pop, comment down below, let me know. Uh, and if you guys want more content beyond just these reaction videos, I do have tutorials here as well. Uh, Hip-hop dance tutorials for beginners, breaking tutorials. Uh, I do have interviews with friends who share their insights in becoming a professional dancer, what it's like in the industry, all that stuff. And I also have my social media company's channel you can check out, my, my dance company's channel you can check out, my podcasts that you can check out. And if you guys want to support support you know even more you can check out the patreon and support me there so that's it hope you guys enjoyed today's episode and i will catch you guys soon peace